Hello guys, welcome back to the Binding of Isaac Wrath of the Lamb edition here with Grimord. So um, we had an appalling run last time and we're just going to carry on with Isaac here. Hopefully um, doing a lot better than what we did last time because I think I had 10 minutes in and made, <laughs> made it down about 3 floors. So that was pretty appalling and my excuse was I hadn't played a Let's Play for a while. Um, good news going forward is I am feeling a lot better today. Um, last blood test which I had. which always make me feel worse because I hate needles um, but throat wise it's starting to, to feel better compared to the first video which is an upside and I'm not in now I believe until Thursday uh, which is always a bonus as well I'm going to pick up rosary which is good for a few spirit hearts definitely and going for the first boss and this should be a nice easy boss fight the first one just keep moving Make sure you shoot its head. Once it does the pop-up move and then goes back underground, you can still actually shoot its head, even though it's underground. Uh, so sorry, sir. Worth knowing. Go down to half health. Need a couple more pop-ups. That'd be nice. Go. So we bomb yourself there, but no such luck. Three quarters down. Oh, that's going to hit me. Now we've got two of the same pill here, we're gonna do this one first, bad gas, not great. Luck down even worse, so this means this pill's probably gonna hurt me. Oh, balls of steel. That's not too bad. We're we're doing alright for spirit hearts here. Rosary is always gonna have the chance of giving spirit hearts, I believe, as well, so we might amass quite a few. Just need to work on stuff like damage if we've got the ability to get spirit hearts now, so Um, so yeah, if we just get some damage, something like a pentagram, that sort of thing. Uh, maybe a tear effect. We're going to shoot the poo just to try and get some keys as well. I'm still unsure about what videos I'm going to be doing. Um, just going to try to find there. Um, yeah, I'm thinking. Oh, I don't. Thinking of FTL maybe um, as the next one, but like I say, it's not 100% confirmed. It really does depend on how I feel. I'm just going to take a long, hard look through my my games list on Steam and that, and see where we can go from here. And I wish I hadn't used that bomb out. Absolutely typical. Um, but yeah, there'll definitely be a new series on here very shortly. Um, like I say, I've. I don't mind doing Minecraft and it will be a good way to help get some more followers as well because Minecraft videos um, seem to be a great place to start for many people but I really don't know if it's cheaping out, that is the problem. I like playing Minecraft so it's not like I'm doing it just to get subscribers but obviously the more subscribers I have uh, the more feedback I have, the more I know about my channel and that sort of thing. So, yeah, it's it's, it's tough, tough choices. Um, really undecided on it, but I keep looking at certain games on it, which would be good for a short Let's Play series. I might carry on with Isaac kind of all the way through, which would be quite good because Isaac is a good one to, to be doing all the way through. I think. Just about to gas there, but. Um, yeah, like I say, I'm looking, looking at my desktop now, really, just kind of thinking about what I could do. Like I say, Space Pirates and Zombies would be quite a fun one. Um, oh, we're going to take technology here, definitely. It's not too bad a, an upgrade. Uh, yeah, we're just going to take technology. And unfortunately, we're going to have to miss out on the item room, so we're going to go down the floor here. Um, but yeah, so we've got, that, like I say, Space Pirate Zombies, we've got Terraria, Minecraft, um, and Pele the Heist with a couple of friends might be an option. Like I say, Guild Wars would be a very, ah, oh, I got stuck there. Uh, Guild Wars would be a very good option, um, just for a few Let's Play videos, definitely, but again, not 100% decided on. 
Dark Souls if I get oh, stupid damage. Uh, Dark Souls if I get a controller would be quite nice. I played it with my um, mouse and keyboard, but it was absolutely horrendous. Uh, there's a couple of more indie games: Din's Curse and a dungeon crawler, quite good fun. Uh, along with the, uh, I just didn't make that time. Um, that's really poor. Too busy talking. Um, too busy concentrating on my desktop. Sorry. Yeah, Din's Curse is fun. Dungeon crawler. And then you've got the space version of it, which is Drox Operative. Um, a lot of these are cult games though, so it's not really going to appeal to the masses. Uh, Dungeon Defenders I had quite good fun on. Um, and like I say, there are a few in, in that bundle which I'm very tempted to get. It's going to be annoying. Um, I'm not getting keys here, which is quite annoying. These three heads as well are being a pain. But I should be. Oh, for God's sake, I keep taking. It, like I say, I can tell I haven't played for a while because this seems to happen to me. Even if I had the the upgraded items, this seems to be the case. I just take real stupid damage, and it winds me up because I shouldn't take stupid damage. I'm also gonna have to take a hit and go for this self-sacrifice room because I need keys so there's only a small chance and that didn't happen but I'm happy with two spirit arts to be honest um, so I could try for the secret room here but I'm not gonna be there because that was a silly bomb to waste because um, we had the self-sacrifice room next to it and it always goes into the secret room so that was a very stupid move but well, and take damage immediately. I've noticed that this boss seems to be the boss that most people take damage from. It's the well, one of the easiest bosses most people take damage from. For some reason, it just seems very difficult to get your bearings right, and a lot of people take damage from it. And it's like such an easy boss, but when there's two of them, everyone seems to just struggle with it, which I find quite odd. We get another health upgrade here as well. And I'm this run is practically over, I think it's safe to say. I'm not gonna make it too far because I missed two rooms already. And that is really, really horrid luck. Uh, that's not bad luck, that's just stupid dodge. Um but yeah, missing two secret rooms is a massive massive downer. Um Yeah, it could have been anything in there. Like, I hope uh, this is gonna it's gonna end badly. I might even die in this room. Oh, okay, there I saw uh, some keys. We am gonna die in this room. Yeah. Again, a really short episode. Um Yeah, I don't know what to do. I'm gonna I'm gonna end it here because I'm gonna I'm gonna do a couple more videos to be honest. So I will end it here, upload this one. <laughs> And I'm going to keep the videos coming on my, well, effectively I've got near on seven days off now. So I'm just going to keep rolling through the videos, get, like I say, get the, the stocks up on videos. Hopefully that will attract more followers. I'm going to look at making a splash screen as well for my videos, which would be quite good. But yeah, and all I'd say is just kind of, the, the thing at the moment I'd like you guys to do is, is share. Share and um, offer feedback to myself because the more shares I get, the more viewers I get, the more videos I can make because of that um, like I say I'm going to get a new mic soon as well because it's starting to be fuzzy as well which has been a, a bit of a pain because it's a proper headset mic and it's quite new but yeah just share with friends and, uh, and offer me feedback and like I say I'll upload another video shortly for you guys um, but yeah thanks for watching speak to you soon